Uh, Steph just mentioned that Jasmine Veal is live near the 405 uh, and the 5 interchange. Jasmine? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, th th what a mess out here. You have cars scattered all over the 5 freeway. And I want to point out first, right behind me, just getting word that the driver of that mangled Dodge Challenger has been arrested for DUI. You have all lanes closed here on the southbound side of the 5 indefinitely uh, after nearly a dozen cars crashed into each other around 1.30 this morning. I want to pull in CHP officer uh, Florentino Oliveira this morning. Uh, what can you give us? What is the latest? on the victims. We're hearing uh, one woman was killed and her six-month-old baby boy in serious condition. What we have right now is, unfortunately, the mom did pass away due to the traffic collision. The six-year-old or six-month-old baby was transported to the hospital. I'm not sure on the injuries. All right. The other victims, uh, eight other, a dad, his two kids. There was two separate crashes. The very first crash involved two vehicles. The second one involved seven vehicles. Due to the second crash, there were several injuries. Okay. And, and just listing off some of those injuries uh, this morning, uh, like I mentioned, you have a 10 and 11 year old kid and their dad in one car. Uh, we're hearing a teenager, an 18 year old, and another, plus three other adults, and a woman in her 20s also had minor injuries. A dog somehow made it out okay. Everyone taken to four separate hospitals. But when you say two crashes, so it was started by this man who was arrested for DUI in that Dodge Challenger. That is correct. The first crash involved the Dodge Challenger, which was driven by a male driver, and that driver was arrested for driving under the influence. And we don't know how the second crash happened? No, we don't know how the second crash happened at this time. Okay. Any word on a timeline uh, of these lanes reopening right before you meet the 405? It's going to take several hours before we even open up any of these lanes. So we do ask the public, please be patient, use alternate routes. Okay. Uh, Jeff and Sharon, uh, that is the latest uh, from here. We're going to come back in about a half hour with more details on uh, this huge crash, multi-vehicle deadly crash out here wow. on the southbound hey, side of the 5 freeway. But Jasmine, you may have said yeah. this. How long do they think that freeway is going to be shut down? Yeah, he even said several more hours. They don't even several have a hours. time frame at this point. You have cars. Look to my left. I just want to show you even some of the work. I mean, we're in between, like he said, um, nine, 10, 11 cars that are just scattered about across all oh, lanes, and they're yeah. just now beginning to tow some of them away. But of course, right. with this fatal accident, this investigation will take quite some time. Yeah, Got no it. doubt about it. Jasmine, thank you.